high brand tech here where tech is made simple just a quick video to let you know that in microsoft edge canary which is a pre-release version of the edge browser which is used for testing and experimenting you can now access and play microsoft network games directly within the edge canary browser now this new feature seems to be on a controlled rollout and i have been waiting for quite some time now and i see that i finally got the new games um, option in edge canary on my windows 11 device today and still not on my windows 10 device so you might have received the games feature already if you are trying out features in edge canary and if not i'm sure just be patient as i'm sure you'll get it in the near future now the easiest way to access uh, the new games in Edge Canary is just to head up to your menu and yeah you will see a new entry called games and if we click on it it opens up a side panel which is very similar as an example like when you um, pin your collections to the side of your desktop and yeah we can just see your editors pick Microsoft classics and um, good old Microsoft Solitaire is also in there and the more you play obviously it'll pick up um, your history and we'll add editors picks trending this week popular game collections and so on and to play a game you know all you do is you just click on one of the games in the panel and this will launch the microsoft network games website within the actual edge canary browser where you'll be able to play whatever game of your choice now another way to access the new games in uh, edge canary is if we just head back to that menu and now we go to settings and head to appearance you'll see here they've added a new games button which is toggled off by default and to enable that shortcut button we just toggle that on and yeah you'll see now you have a new games button which is a nice handy shortcut if this is a feature you would like to try out and use and clicking on it takes us back to that side panel so the games button just acts as a shortcut to that actual entry in the actual menu itself now as i mentioned this is on a controlled rollout and it's still early days like most features in edge canary so at this stage it's too early to say if this will actually make its way down to the stable version of microsoft edge but i will keep you posted and update you as i get more information so i hope you found this video useful once again thanks for watching and i will see you in the next one